Does your saw not turn on? Is it sparking near the brushes? If so, you probably need a new set of carbon brushes. The carbon brushes transfer electricity to the motor's armature. They consist of a carbon brush, a wire lead, and a spring that keeps the brush pressed tightly against the armature. The carbon brush is soft and will wear down over time from constant contact with the spinning commutator on the armature. When the brush is worn out, it will no longer make good contact with the armature and the saw won't turn on. Often, when a brush is nearly worn out, it will cause excessive sparking around the commutator. This can also be a symptom of a bad armature, so if you see sparks, you will want to inspect it as well. Replacing the carbon brushes is an easy repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. I'll begin by removing the old motor brush from the motor. It's held in place under the brush cap. The brush cap just simply screws in place. So I'll unscrew it. Grab the spring and wire lead and pull the brush away from the motor. Now I can install the new brush. I line up the brush with the brush holder. I'll insert the brush all the way into the holder, followed by the spring. You want to make sure you don't get the, kink, the spring kinked. It should go all the way into the brush holder. And then as I hold that in place, I'll slide the brush cap over the end of the brush and secure it. A trick you can use here with these brush caps is turn it the wrong way first as if you were loosening it and you'll hear it click. You'll actually kind of feel it snap into place like that and then secure it. That'll keep you from cross-threading the brush cap. And we'll repeat this process on the other side. First the brush cap. Pull the brush away, install the new brush, insert the spring into the holder, hold that in place while you place the brush cap. 